Hey guys, it's Tina here. Welcome back to my channel. This hack episode is all about eyeshadows. I always find it much easier to apply my eyeshadows once my brows are done. That way I have the shape there and I sort of have that clean area to work with. So I usually fill my eyebrows in before I apply any eyeshadows. Also, it's really important to apply an eyeshadow base. You can either use concealer or an eyeshadow primer. This will help to knock out any of that sort of redness or discoloration in your eyelids and also smooth out the area. Once you've applied the concealer or the eyeshadow primer, make sure you set it with a translucent powder. This is going to help you blend the eyeshadow colors much better. The eyeshadows won't stick and grab onto any tacky areas, so it's going to make your blending very easy. Now before you even start applying eyeshadow, it's really important to select the correct tools. I recommend to have two brushes on hand, one a fluffy one for blending and another one that's not so fluffy, it's a bit flatter and that one's to lay down the colours. When choosing eyeshadow colours, I recommend to have three colours, a transition shade, a darker shade to add depth and dimension and also a highlighting shade. A good hack is to use the fluffy brush to apply the transition shade first. This colour is going to go into the crease and you're going to blend it upwards. Once you're happy with that, you can apply the darker colour and using the flat brush, we're going to pat that into the deeper areas. By using a patting motion, you're going to build up the colour and intensity. Once you're happy with the colour, go back to your fluffy brush and blend it out. You want to blend it in with your transition colour. Now, what if you don't have a lot of eyeshadows and you don't have a transition colour? A good hack for that is you can use a blush. You can apply the transition colour on top of the dark colour to blend it out and that's just going to help create that nice smoky effect. When it comes to the lighter colour or the highlight colour, I like to apply that into the inner corner of my eyes and also in the centre. If you don't have a highlighting shade but you have a highlighter, you can actually use this on your eyes. All you have to do is wet your brush to intensify any of the highlighting shades. If you want to make your eyes bigger using eyeshadows, a good hack is to really run that along your lower lash line and really diffuse it out. Don't be afraid to bring that colour down a bit further, this will help make your eyes look bigger. What if you're a beginner and you're pretty heavy handed with your eyeshadows? You can use some translucent powder, all you have to do is dip your fluffy brush into some translucent powder and run it across your eyeshadows. This will help blend and lighten up the colour. This next hack is great for those of you who want to turn your eyeshadows into eyeliner. All you're going to need is a mixing medium from MAC. And I've just got some eyeshadow on my palette and I'm just going to mix it in with mixing medium. Once combined, you can use this as eyeliner. Now you can pretty much turn any of your eyeshadows into eyeliners. Lastly, to amp up any eyeshadow looks, you can just apply lashes. Here I'm using the Ardell Glamour Wispy Lashes. So that's it to this eyeshadow hack episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed another one of my videos. If you haven't already, check out some of the other hack videos in my series and make sure you subscribe to my channel to stay updated with future videos that I post. I'll speak to you guys next time. Bye.